Welcome back to the channel and welcome to Puerto Rico. It's almost our last day of the trip, but it took me this long to get these frickin' rope climbers to do some proper climbing. Better late than never though, right? Today we're on the west side of the island bouldering at Surfers slash Survivors Beach. More specifically, we're starting out at one of the most beautiful bouldering locations I've ever seen, known as the Balcony. So here's the start of the 3 plus, kind of matched in it, good undercling, decent move, good jug though, really good jug. <laughs> then you're into the crimps, that's the crux, and then ultimately making a pretty big move to the slip it's also rather sharp so you got to kind of make that move carefully top out's pretty featured and juggy fortunately yeah i'm on my game all day the same all day took me a long time but never quit it no way and i high nothing i ain't doing too pay so my beat flying kicks kind of like i'm no way creating a fiasco kind of like i'm hooray did a party like an 18 kind of like i'm hooray Oh, foot. Limestone is usually a biological sedimentary rock, forming from the accumulation of, among other things, coral. If you've ever felt coral reef in the ocean, it is extremely sharp. The classic limestone you may be familiar with is not quite so sharp as this, but the rock we're climbing on today is somewhere in between. Nice, dude. It is extremely sharp and definitely requires some taping to make some of these holds bearable. Oh yeah, sick. That time you made it look easy. Yeah, dude. Uh-huh. Woo, keep it. Left crimp, maybe? Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Nice, dude. Four plus, it's uh, just to the left of that line. Sit start on a jug, bomber under cling here. Blah, blah. Start of the crux here. Left hand into this really sharp guy, wanted to tape up for that. Up and into another sharp crimp dish. Moves to the lip, drop off, down climb on the left side of the boulder here. If you have a person move the pad, that's ideal. And views for days, man. boulders and check out the ocean down there on the beach a little further along is the wave boulder and what's called best boulder so we'll be checking those out here in low tide in a couple hours I mean it's still wet but yeah. wasn't it like hammering that thing it, yeah the waves were smacking up and like into it before so a little low. like a few inches maybe uh, I guess they're kind of still smacking it there. Maybe I haven't made much. I'm always up to something. My adrenaline is pumping and I'm always making green. Get it cut like I'm pumping and that's why these blockers fronting. Cause they always on the block and I'm leaving the parking lot across the world and they're not going anywhere. My shit is very rare. The hell with these elevated boys. I had to climb many stairs. One of a kind man, but not often a kind man. I'm always on the pitch. I'm not a line man. Get it? Turn 
the beat up, turn the turn the beat up. First V Plur plus sent in a harness and quick draws. <laughs> If you've watched any of my previous videos, you probably know what I'm going to say right now, but I don't care and I'm going to say it anyways. Always use a top out cam. I definitely did not do it the same exact beta, but... Yeah, Brandon reclimbed this one for me so I could film him. Ouch! So sharp! And as you can tell, him and Adio already moved on to more frickin' sport climbing, man. Adio hates bouldering, man. And if you ever meet him out in the wild and he tells you something different, don't believe him. <clears throat> He's lying. If you're comfy, if you can toss that camera to me, that'd be cool. Sweet. Brandon, on the other hand, is an excellent sport, and I can't wait to boulder with him more. Hi, dude. Beautiful. Sick. As you can probably tell, the waves continue to pummel the boulders further down the beach. Turns out it wasn't so much of a tide issue and more about the mega swell hammering this side of the island and currently thrashing Mike B with some 8 to 10 foot waves as well. So as the sun start to set we turned our gaze westward down the beach in search of one more final boulder before nightfall. I'm good bro, I ate off the knife. The camera never does it justice, but this thing is kind of tall and pretty scary in the dark. I wasn't sure we were going to top it until Brandon cracked open the beta with some jugs up top. I like giving these guys a hard time about not bouldering more, but we did have a blast the rest of the trip on some of the best limestone sport climbing I've ever seen. Maybe some of the best outside of Europe, or it may even contend with that within Europe. We also had an awesome multi-pitch day with some killer views, so if you want to see that, make sure to subscribe so you don't miss the videos. Thanks for watching.
cosa de la calle. Mira la morena. Mira, mira, mira cómo mueve. Once asesina, no vas a te get it. Asesina de todas las mujeres.